Welcome once again, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, to Mysteries from Beyond the Other Dominion. I'm your host, Dr. Franklin Rule. Now, roll tape. Next we have T-Rex, Tyrannosaurus Rex, the king of the dinosaurs. Now, T-Rex flourished from 72 million to 65 million years ago. He was right there at the end of the dinosaur era in the Cretaceous period. Height, about 20 feet, the equivalent of a two-story building. His teeth, seven inches long. As far as his weight, four to seven tons, he had the most powerful jaws of any creature that ever lived on our planet. Now, it's believed he could charge rhinoceros fashion for a short time after its prey. But if it did catch the prey, it then had a second option. It's believed he is also a carrion eater a scavenger who consumed dead dinosaurs. Now please note that his front limbs seem to be mutated, too short to fit into his mouth to help him eat dinner. What was their purpose? Well, one intriguing theory is that he slept crocodile fashion at night, and then those powerful mutated forelimbs pushed him to an upright stance in the morning. By the way, he was basically an American dinosaur found in Montana, for example, he had relatives also in Canada and Mongolia. And when he ran, whether it was fast or slow, which is still being debated, it was with the tail off the ground for proper leverage. He was no tail dragger. Another mystery that still surrounds him, whether it's warm-blooded or cold-blooded, top paleontologists have taken both sides of that controversial issue. Any future updates, and you'll learn about them right here on Mysteries from Beyond the Other Dominion. Now until next time, may the power of the cosmos be with you. Yes, yes, yes.